Are you ready for the final battle, Pit? It's now or never. For this final battle, you're equipped with the three sacred treasures. Using the Pegasus wings and power of flight at the same time seems like overkill. Who knows how reliable the Pegasus wings are after all this time? I've turned them off. Understood. There sure are a lot of underworld enemies around here. Yes, so even though the arrows of light do a lot of damage, don't get cocky. This ravine leads to the underworld. I'm taking you in. Look at those trail tails going lines. Or trails, right? Maybe. Probably. I don't advise shooting for a little bit. The shoot flies here will react to your fire. I think they're onto me. Shoot fly territory. The entrance to the underworld should be up ahead. I hope the gem from Thanatos works. Watch out for Orns ahead. Did you see that? They were no match for your arrows. The three sacred treasures have still got it. Thanatos' gem is shiny. That means we're good to go. Get ready. Whoa! The underworld. We finally made it. That's a whole lot of enemies. Well, we are there in the field. Home or away, I fight to win. In your past adventures, the underworld was where you died the most, right? Oh, absolutely. The difficulty level was just brutal. I'll brace for the worst. The metal backs on Boogities resist everything, even arrows of light. So be careful. <sighs> Pitu! What did you just call me? What are you doing here? The same thing you're doing. Pummeling underworld fools. I'm just way better at it. Maybe you also sense that Pit could use your help. Don't make me laugh. Now enough talk to talk. There's fighting to be done. I'm out of here. It was nice of you to show up, Pit too. But I can handle this on my own. You're not on your own, Pit. You have me. <laughs> of course. What would I do without you? Watch your back! Isn't that Isn't just, just precious? precious. Guess, it's Guess it's all that, all that hot, hot air, air that keeps you flying. You, you are, darling. darling. But you'll need, but you'll need more than bluster, bluster to defeat me. This isn't bluster! In the name of the Goddess of Light, I will defeat you! What is that? That's the last line of defense keeping us out of the Underworld Castle. It won't be keeping me out. damage. Well, it is a boss. It's so annoying. take out a boss. For future reference, face kicking isn't usually this effective. Get a move on before more defenses show up. Patu's right. We should go, even if it means taking orders from him. Thanks, Patu. Please stop calling me that. Pit, get ready to go in. We're fine. 
finally here. Look at these boss statues. It seems that each statue has a corresponding door. This place again. This looks like where you fought the huge rock. Some kind of illusion? It's as real as I am. I built it myself using your and the Hugh memories. That's because you don't know what the original town looked like. No matter. You're in my domain now. And you'll play by my rules. Yeah? Well, some rules are meant to be broken. Castle entrance. Look, a statue has crumbled. This looks like where I had my first battle. You've really come a long way since then, haven't you?
Watch out, Pit. It's a clubber skull. Yeah, I figured that part out. Got any other ideas of what I should do next? You'll have to defeat it to advance. Dodge to avoid getting hurt and go in for melee attacks when you can. Aye, aye, Lady Palutena. Medusa. Uh, now this is one place I wish I could forget. The Labyrinth of Deceit. Which means a second helping of crazy. Ugh. some fake spice to stop me.
What just happened? I think he just used a warp of some sort. turned around. You seem to be passing between the floor and ceiling. How very strange. You're telling me. Hey, a secret area. You're one step closer to getting out of this place. Nicely 
nearly done, Pit. You've destroyed all three statues. Then it's time to destroy Medusa. The path to Medusa is back the way you first came in. How's that even possible? Make your way to Medusa. I'm on it! Meleeing the little enemies into the big enemy will make things easier for you. respond to shots being fired. Also, that statue-like enemy is a suit of scuttler and can only be hurt from behind. I find it very ironic that you would call yourself the goddess of light. After all, it was you who turned me into a monster. It was you who hunted me down. You shouldn't blame me for that. I only reflected in your appearance what I saw in your heart. And what about your heart? I can only imagine what resides there. Why just imagine it? Don't you have the power to make it a reality? There's no point. We all know it would be some sort of hit. Medusa, but what I don't get is how you managed to resurrect yourself in the first place. I suppose I don't really understand how that happened either. Don't play dumb with me. I don't remember what happened. My memories aren't what they were. You're slipping, Medusa. Your mind isn't all there anymore. And I can sense that your life force is weaker than it used to be. Twin Bellows, Hudra, Pandora, and Thanatos have all been defeated. But if you withdraw your army and promise to stay in this castle, I will spare you. <laughs> Don't be ridiculous. Besides, it hardly matters how I return. What matters is why. To exact revenge on you. Turning your little angel into stone is a nice first step. Threaten all you want. You Don't scare me. I will put an end to it. I'll return to Skyworld victorious!
if you get a close fit. There's nowhere left for you to run! You know, I'm very much looking forward to your arrival. I feel like Rapunzel waiting for her prince. Sorry to break it to you, but those aren't exactly golden locks on your head. And you're not exactly a brave hero. Yet somehow the thought of our confrontation fills me with anticipation. So hurry to me. I'll strip you of your wings and sever you from the heavens forever. I don't think so. Somewhere. Step on the switch and use the lights to guide your way. There are hidden platforms nearby that you can jump on. First, reveal the platforms, then dash up to a ledge to jump. Well, that's easy. Temporal Whatsard? If he deep fries you, keep your distance. One bite and you'll be finished. Well, that's a step up from Eggplant, I guess. No. Not really. <sighs>
We're getting close to Medusa. Be careful not to fall. Medusa's defeat. There's an Arenas nearby. They split into two halves that you can take out one at a time. Uh, it looks like the bottom half lost its pants.
did it! We really did it! Congratulations! I know it wasn't always easy. Oh, but it was so worth it. With the world at peace again, even the sun feels warmer. Aw, oh, you're so cute, Pit. <laughs> <laughs> now wait, wait just, just a second. second. Huh? Did you hear something? I said, I said wait, wait just, just a second. second. Got to be hearing things. <laughs> Hades? Who's Hades? The true master of the underworld. Sorry, Sorry to keep to you, you waiting, but now that I'm here, let's, let's get, get this, this party, party started. started. Welcome, Welcome to, to my underworld, underworld. Pretty, pretty fat. fat. You too, pretty fallatated. I'm honored you know who I am. So this so little this angel took down Big Bad Medusa, Medusa all by himself. By himself. What, what an accomplishment. An accomplishment. Goodness, you should you put this on your resume. resume. Uh, what's with this guy? But before, but before you, you do, do, you should, should know that, that I whipped I up that Medusa, Medusa especially for you. Wait, how? Add a pinch of memories to a ton of souls. Put them in a blender and hit frappe. Explain yourself! Her thirst for revenge was so great it seemed a shame to let it go to waste. Oh, pretty Valentina, you must have done a real number on her. I won't deny that. But she's old news, and old news bores me. We must look to the future, and that future is me, the true leader of the underworld. Next to me, little Miss Medusa's going to look like a sweet, cuddly bunny. No, this can't be happening. I must bid you adieu.